conclude, time management is an issue that most of our society, although mainly places a focus on students, is what we struggle with today and for many years in the past as well. Because most of our society struggles with managing their time, it is important that we have an understanding of how we can overcome these obstacles that keep us from self-managing our schedule and obtain time management skills for the better of our time needs. Therefore, Myrna explains the scientific management theory developed by scientific theorist Frederick William Taylor, which gives us an insight that time management has been an issue since the 1900s and upon this Frederick Taylor developed an experiment in contrast to increasing the ability of others being productive specifically setting goals such as planning and scheduling are ways of improving that time management skill we all desire however as Alicia stated in her video because everything has changed so much over time, we don't have the time to go and write in our journals like we used to, but instead we depend our, on our technology, or phones if you will, to remind us of our necessities such as assignments and important deadlines. Although this technology should be used to help us and not to distract us. Instead of this helping us self-manage our time, it becomes a distraction and takes more out of our time. Therefore, we go into the issue of time management and what keeps us from being organized or productive with our time. But the main concern to this problem would be deciding how we choose to spend our time. Procrastination plays a major role in deciding this due to the certainty that it goes into time management. Sometimes we think to ourselves that we're going to get something done a certain way, but our coordinated plans don't always go how we expect. We then come to the solution that the way for time management to take an effect on us is by removing all distractions from our computers, tablets, etc. As Vanessa said in her video, Chafing has logins for all students where we are only allowed to access educational related sources. And this actually turns out to be very convenient because Chafing wants students to succeed and we don't want those other distractions to get in the way of our learning or main focus. The way our solution would help students manage their time is by allowing a web browser to block these distractions from their devices when it comes to focusing on schoolwork. Therefore, blockage or unrelated school assignments is more likely to increase the chances of 90% of students to become less distracted and more productive. 